crazy. Sanding floorboards has become very popular. All the DIY sort of programs say, right, rip the carpet up, let's sand the floorboards, and short term can look really good. Um, the disadvantage to it, a floorboard was always meant to be covered. It was never meant to be exposed. It's a soft wood, mm. so it will mark an indent very, very easily, especially with stilettos, especially with dragging any bits of furniture across it. Um, also, the biggest disadvantage with people in this country is that it's cold and there's no insulation underneath your floorboards and there's a gap between your floorboards. So what happens is, it's lovely in the summer, come October, November, December, you end up putting a big rug covering it all over or you're sitting there, very cold, heating bills are going up. The advantage with a real wood or a solid wood, it's a sealed floor. Once this covers the floor, there's no gaps in it. Uh, there's no drafts coming up, it's insulated. Um, it's a hard wood, so basically it's not gonna scratch and mark as much as a softwood. Saying that, you can still damage a real wood floor, so you've got to bear that in mind. Brilliant.